When Julian Castro was elected mayor of San Antonio, Texas in May of 2009, he became the youngest mayor of a top 50 American city. And ever since, he's championed a vision of economic growth and a top-notch quality of life for all San Antonians in a city increasingly becoming the new face of the American dream. We have the extreme pleasure of welcoming to the executive report none other than the mayor of San Antonio himself, Mr. Julian Castro. Mayor Castro, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. Now, Mayor Castro, in what ways is San Antonio becoming a model for what Texas and the rest of the U.S. will look like? Now, San Antonio is a model in a couple of different ways. First, uh, it's now the seventh largest city in the United States, the second largest in Texas, and one of the fastest growing. It has a very diverse local economy, and for that reason has been ranked as one of the most recession-resistant cities in the United States. And it's also a very diverse city, uh, a place where folks of different backgrounds, different perspectives, different cultures have come together, and they live well together, they work well together. So in that sense, demographically, the city is, is a real look at the Texas and the America of tomorrow. Well, you've made some serious strides leading a couple of very crucial programs that are improving education and community in San Antonio. Can you describe them for our listeners? Sure. You know, we recognize here in San Antonio that in this 21st century global economy, brain power is the new currency of success. So what we're trying to create is a brain power community that is the liveliest metropolis in the United States. To that end, we created Cafe College, which is a one-stop center that services everyone in San Antonio, that offers free counseling on admissions and financial aid, as well as free ACT and SAT preparation courses. We also partnered with Trinity University, the local Metropolitan Transit Authority, uh, and a host of others, including the San Antonio Independent School District, to take a look at one zone on the east side of the city and invest in the infrastructure and the neighborhood there, as well as innovate in the schools in that feeder pattern so that we solve that chicken and egg problem of trying to lift up a neighborhood where the schools may not be that great, and at the same time trying to lift up schools where the neighborhoods have become dilapidated and they need investment. And we believe that by taking this kind of hands-on approach, it's going to help us to lift student achievement in the long run. Mayor Castro, thanks for taking the time to join us today. All right. Thank you. We've been speaking with Julian Castro, mayor of San Antonio. Visit them at sanantonio.gov.